Aztec Bowl may not be much to look at now, but it had its heyday back in the 60s. It was here that President John F. Kennedy accepted an honorary doctorate degree. It was also here Coach Don Coriel led his Aztecs to victory. It was built for football, and Don Coriel had his best years in the bowl. Ann Rizzo heads up a group that wants to save Aztec Bowl. She doesn't want it changed. She says its history is too precious to destroy. The bowl was built during the Depression, completely by hand. It was built by unskilled laborers. It created jobs in the community. And um, the way it was built, if you look at the walls, all that um, rubble and rocks is actually excavated from the site. Everything here, including this concession stand, were built entirely by hand. The idea is to now build a student activity center and an arena at a cost of about $25 million. A spokesperson for the college says the plans would not destroy the bowl. Some of the original features would be retained and new construction would be added. Students seem divided on Aztec Bowl. I think it should be saved because the bowl's been around in San Diego State for a long time and uh, it helps a lot of athletes train. It's, uh, it's the home of the rugby team and uh, practice field for the volleyball team, the soccer team. To me it doesn't mean much because I've never been in it and um, I don't really know what goes on there. Those who want this left untouched are asking that this be declared a historical site. No one knows yet if the Aztec Bowl's time has run out. Gina Lou News 8, SDSU.